questions. Mm. Wait, so you, you disagree that you should be earning that much? I mean, to me, it just comes down to economics. There are men that are prepared to pay money to see you naked. And naked. I suppose, but there is like no world where I should be making more than a doctor. Mm -hmm. Like mm -hmm. that's fucked. Right. Yeah. 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 I mean, thank you. <laughs> but well, like, I don't get it. <laughs> Commodifying the coomers. It is so over. The West has fallen. Um. <laughs> I, I think that, well, women, we're just talking about women. Um, I think we're wanting more and not giving anything what for do you, it. What do you want? So, well, me personally. Or just, ge just generally. No, in general. And I, I, I feel like um, people are just taking advantage of situations um, more now than ever. And I feel like women. Like with OnlyFans? Who's getting taken not advantage only, of it? Not only fans in general, which is people. Like people are expecting you. Like girls are expecting you to show up in a certain way, but they're not showing up like that. Mm. That's facts. So that is I facts. just, that's. How are they expecting you to show up and how are they not showing however up? However they imagine their world, like how they want you to be, whether they want you to be 6'3 and successful, but at the end of the day, like what are you bringing as well to the table? And it's an excellent point. It's an excellent point. I have a question for all you ladies. Oh, here we go. Yeah. It's, a, it's a good one. On a scale of one to 10, how would you rate yourself as a potential wife or a current wife? Oh. Are, would you be would you be a valuable wife to have? I think I would be a good wife because when in a relationship I am monogamous, I cook, I clean, I would adhere to traditional gender roles. But because of my past, that might knock me down a few pegs. Um, Wait, but you're, you're saying the, the 300 body count by the time you retire? If it gets to that, yeah, might work against you. <laughs> Some people might not be down with that. <laughs> That's fair enough. Um, but I think in in the sense of being a wife, I would be a good wife. Yeah. Okay. To your credit, though, I think you have like a really good sort of self awareness. Yeah, like yes. you Thank don't seem you. to take yourself too seriously, and uh, so. Thank you. It's very attractive too. Thanks. Guys. Oh, maybe there's a little connection there. No, I don't there. do. Girls, no, I, don't do. Uh, no, I mean, you do. Girls. Hold on, you do OnlyFans. She does OnlyFans. I, this is the collaboration is, here. We could collab, but I'm not. Ryan I'm not doing any girls. Society like, right now. Not, I'm not, not into girls. Really You're not either. into chicks. Not my thing. No, never kissed a girl. Nothing. Okay. Uh, Shut that one down. <laughs> do you think you make a good wife? Yeah, I would say you said on a scale. I would say I'm about like an eight or a nine. I do have my room for improvement. I have yeah. a squirrel brain, ADD, so some things slip through the cracks. But I feel <laughs> yeah. like I provide. I'm the nurturer role, right? We were talking earlier about the submission to your husband. He is more of the leader, managing finances in the grand scheme of things. I cook, I clean, I maintain the house, so I take on that nurturer role where he takes on that power leadership role. Okay, based. Very nice. Jubilee, what about you? How good of a wife do you think you'd make? To Brian. Scale one to Brian. To Brian. I, I know you think he's cool. What, what do you bring into the um, table? Um, this is your show, right? So, I mean, that's a really big accomplishment for yourself. Mm -hmm. Um, I would say if I was a really good wife, I would say maybe a 6. I'm not emotionally stable. Um, You're not emotionally I'm stable. I'm not. Like you might like just pull a knife on him. Not one day. like that. Like, what, just like, what kind of? What's your uh, prescription? I'm not on prescription. No prescription medications. It's just like bipolar. I, I BPD. Just cry a lot. I'm a very emotional oh, person. Oh, you you That's cry a like, lot. Yeah, mm. but I could oh. control it. You can control the crying. I can control it. Um, Is the wedding off? <laughs> I'm listening. <laughs> I'm listening. She is. How tall are you? It's like barely five foot. On a good day, four yeah, eleven. Four eleven or five. No, it's close. You like four eleven? It's good. It's um, good. I just know in the Short acting world, it's very hard to cry on the spot. So I have the advantage in that type of occupation. So you're saying, as a wife, you'd be a good actress. crier, a good yeah, manipulator. If I, if I had the ability to to do that. But okay, so she's bringing like crying on demand. She's to the emotionally table. unstable. <laughs> I'm all ears. <laughs> emotionally unstable. But what else? Emotionally communication you. is key for sure, obviously. Any negative qualities? Um, there could be. Um, you would have to find that for yourself. I, oh. 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 Right, he's like, I, I, mean, I already have the ring, so the now ring? it's just a matter of time <laughs> until you oh find God. out what it is. Mm -hmm. I need full disclosure. <laughs> Listen, you have got, you been... You got like a gambling problem? Oh, no. no I don't even into the yeah. mic? 
Oh, sorry. Closer to the mic. Yeah. Yeah, let what, me ask. What are we talking here? What skeletons are you hiding in the closet? Nothing. Have I'm, you I'm seen a really therapist in the um, past three months? What was your question? Have you seen a therapist in the past three months? No, but I have previously. Yes. Have you been recommended a therapist in the past three yes. months? Yes. How you many been? times? <laughs> Just once. Have you okay. been involuntarily committed to a mental asylum? Hey, you already no. proposed. You already asked. Yeah, you what? should know. These yeah, are but they right. haven't yeah. said I do yet. Yeah, this it's is not necessary due diligence. Just an no, that's just on her. Um, so you said you're Sorry. mentally unstable? <laughs> or did you say emotionally? Just, just emotionally. Just like, I just cry. Mm -hmm. like just crying? I, a lot? It's just for grieving situations. But do you, yeah. what, like, Mainly. is it tears of joy sometimes? Like, yeah, you cry during joy sex? Sure. Yeah, like, have, you, have you cried during sex? No. Because it was so I good? Oh. No, that, no. Not for sure. That, no. Okay. It was so good. I cried. It was so good. What do you believe? Do you believe besides that's a thing? Besides <laughs> yeah. the emotional yeah, that is a thing, issues, actually. what yeah. are your biggest red flags? Um, I think that's just that one. Just that one. Yeah. You kind of alluded to it a few minutes ago. You were like, "You'll see, you'll see the other ones." Just reveal. Yeah. That's, maybe she doesn't know them yet. Disclose. Yeah. Maybe I don't know. That's maybe that's, I just have that's experience. even worse. Those no, being in a committed relationship, like you. you find things out about yourself. Like if you've never lived with someone before, or if you've never been long to like. Things happen in your life over a span of times that you learn and unveil about yourself that you this didn't is know. True. Tell me about this your alcohol true. consumption. How frequently? I, socially, like maybe once in a while. How I, often do you consume meth? No, no. Heroin? <laughs> <laughs> what, what's that Russian one? Right. Crocodile? Oh, that's Solid. horrible. Crocodile. I don't even know that. I don't know that. As a nurse, we got trained on it. That's like your flash. It's a horrible drug. No, like like bath salts. Like you know, some people I think they smoke bath salts. I don't even honestly. I don't even know about this. I injected it right before. Just one microphone at a time, guys. Um, have you ever slashed a guy's tires? No. Have any of you? No. Do you know the proper way to do it? How? Yeah. Tell us. I mean, I've never done it, but isn't it just two? Anything more than two, it's covered by insurance. I thought it was three. Just you do like the you front, can do three. the yeah, you front, have to leave one. and the back. If you do all four, then, then insurance it's a covered crime. by insurance. Right? Yeah. What? And well, it's still a crime, yeah. but just insurance. Don't give ladies any ideas out there, okay? <laughs> I mean, 10 out of 10, it's don't right, recommend right, slashing right. tires, but if you are going to do it, do it the right way. I think way. she's holding something If you're going to do it, just take them to she's get new tires. It's grieving. It's what? It's grieving. Huh? The grieving part. The grieving part? Yeah. Wait, that's like not that's, a red flag, you though. You're going through a lot. She's recognizing that she's not sad. ready to emotionally commit herself like that. She's so, ready. Which is don't. A, because most guys are ready. She's not going to say yes to you. Please, 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 please don't put words yes. in the four eleven woman's mouth. She's not saying yes to you. She already, she's not the ready. Ring, the ring is on her it's finger, right? It's still on her finger. It's a done deal. It's on her And she said Brian's cool. Like, it's a done deal. Well, that's all you need. That's all yeah. that, yeah. <laughs> it's a rock that's solid, all you need. That's a rock yeah, solid foundation rock. for marriage right there. <laughs> ten out of ten. Yep. yep. Okay. Uh, what the fuck were we were talking about? Wife. What, what, how, wife. how would you... Uh, qualify yep. yourself in terms of being wife material? Just, by the way, just because we have a lot of super chats, if you guys can just make the answers quick. I'd say Nate. An eight. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Um, I'm a wife. I was raised by a wife, a woman who is a wife. So, yeah. You're born to be a wife. Mm -hmm. Yep. Mm -hmm. I was literally raised to be a wife. So based. Yeah. Saluting your parents right now. Yeah. Good Shout job. out to my mom. Amazing yeah. woman. Shout out to her mom. Yeah. What about you? Ten, nine, ten. Well, wow. I mean, what do you the bring to the I, table? I. I bring loyalty. Okay. I bring stability. Okay. I'm going to cook for you. I'm going to take care of you. I, I don't want you to come home and be stressed. And that's not my job. That's not my role. Mm. So, and then growth. Okay. However, that will play out. I mean. What, what, you said you were married once before? No. Oh, no. no, no. Do you get no, child no. support? No, I actually, so me and my daughter's father have a really good relationship, and um, it's just something that I never decided to do. I was able to provide for my daughter, and he does his end however he needs to, just as long as that him and I are doing good, and that's what she's seeing, I don't need to do that. So, and I would probably never take him to child support either, unless it's truly, if I needed it, you know what he's going to provide for her. And Is he it shared custody, or do you have full custody? We don't, we've never been to court. So it's not like, it's just, it's a mutual thing with him and but I. sometimes is he taking well, care of the kid? Yeah, or? he'll take her. Okay. Like he spends time with her and You're everything. So I think that's the most, yeah, yeah. we do co-parenting and that's probably the most, she knows her dad, they have a great relationship. She loves him and that's all she sure. knows, so. Okay. 
Mm. How would you rate yourself, wife, material wise? Mm. I think I'm probably a seven because of the alcoholism, but I'm aware of it, which is good. And it depends. I mean, I want a bunch of kids, so I think I'll be a really good mom. How many kids do you want to have? Like seven or nine. Damn. But I want to adopt like three <laughs> or four. Like, oh. that's awesome. Well, um, you, are you worried about relapsing with the alcoholism down the line? After seven. If I don't marry a good man, I very much worry about relapsing. But the goal is to marry someone who is, if not completely sober, is just like very supportive in that, and you know, helps me with that. What What triggers you to want to relapse? If I may ask. Um, is there like a specific thing? Yeah, you sh- because I'm depressed. I have depression. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> okay, moving on. So super right. chat, super <laughs> chat. Wait, <laughs> Ryan can we ask the, like me. what do you, we, how, how do you guys rate just, yourself on just, a one to ten in terms it. of being able to support I just, as a husband? So yeah, yeah, yeah husband material. Husband no, like material. as a, in, like on the opposite, in the opposite sense, in being husband. a husband, yeah. husband material. I would, I would rate myself a nine. Um, I think my future wife will be very fortunate to be married to me, but I also recognize that like I've got like insecurities, I've got like deep, tra- like deep emotional trauma from mm-hmm. my childhood and stuff that is like a pain in the ass to deal with at times. 